Today we're talking about dividing with unit fractions. Here I have six delicious looking cookies. And you might remember that if I break these into groups of two, that I'm doing the problem six divided by two, and I end up with three groups. But what happens if I have these six cookies and I want to divide them into halves? How many halves are in six? Well, let's break these cookies into halves and count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We have twelve halves in six cookies. You might notice here that twelve is the product of six and two, and that six is our whole number and two is the denominator of the unit fraction we're dividing by. Let's take another look. Here I have four cookies, but I would like to cut these into fourths. How many fourths are in four? Well, you can count, and you'll find that, similar to the last one, it is the product of the whole number and the denominator of the unit fraction, which in this case is 16. Let's take a look at one more. Jesse wants to eat one-fourth of a candy bar every day. We want to know how long two candy bars will last her. So if she starts with two candy bars and she breaks them into fourths, how many fourths will she have? Similar to the last two, we can tell this is going to be the product of two and four. If you're unsure about that and you want to double check, you could do a little sketch. Just sketch yourself out a couple candy bars and then cut them into fourths. So chop, 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 chop. Now I can see I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight fourths in these two candy bars. Okay, now go and try a few of these on your own, dividing a whole number by a unit fraction. 